Before we get into today's video, I just want to send a message of support to my Ukrainian friends and people that watch this video, and also people from other nations that are getting brought up into this conflict and everything. It's horrible. I'm not going to pretend to be an expert. All I will say, a couple of things I want to say on it is do your own research, multiple sources. Don't just go, oh, I trust that guy. I'm just going to believe whatever he says. Do all your research and everything. Get all the facts for yourself. And also a little call to, I follow a bunch of YouTubers and FM YouTubers. Now is not the the time to make jokes on Twitter about it. I've seen multiple jokes on Twitter about it from football manager YouTubers today. Um, and all I will say is, how about not being a for a day? How about that? Just maybe leave it, yeah? A few likes is not going to do anything for you, okay? Moving on, let's go play some football manager. I want to keep this area a place where you can just watch and forget about real life shit. So let's move on. But I hope all goes well. I hope our leaders can collectively grab their testicles and do something about it so ah shit isn't it but let's move on <music> greetings and salutations my friends welcome back so two things the board have injected 220,000 into running the club it made a big dent um, secondly, they've picked the playoff relegation game as a fan day, so that could go very much one of two ways, uh, and we've got a team meeting for the playoff final. Okay, we, we smashed the last one, I'm on a roll. We just go for the same thing as last time because it worked? <laughs> Genius. Okay, obviously we've got suspensions because football manager. Um, okay. Who's going to play? Dom's back. That's good. Um, right. Lilo is our key man. Top goal scorer. Banging him in. Now, who do we play up top? Like, four, I'm just going to call him 14. Um, <laughs> am I just going to give him a num actual number as a name? That is very confusing. Right, 14. Oh, that's a new one for me. He started well and he looked like, okay, that was, maybe this is the guy. We could go Galan, he's, he's got his, okay, oh, no, there's a no longer. No, stick with, we looked at the players, 14 is a decent player, okay? <clears throat> he's going to be fine. Uh, right, Lungi. The midfield picks itself, left back. Now we know this guy's joining. Um, annoying. He's play left back. Not okay. So I'm going to put Capaferi there, and you go there. That's the way around. I want it. Okay, and you're joining us as well. That's nice. Lovely time. Goalkeeper's having a better couple of games. Dickman is doing Dickman stuff. Okay, this is it, my friends. Alex, you're probably watching this in bed with your son Tommy. So I'm going to win this for you, but. If I lose, it's 100% on your fault. Right? Or Vicky's fault. It's probably Vicky's fault. Blake, let's blame Vicky if it doesn't work. Right. Okay. Here we go. No nerves whatsoever. We're going to have a lovely time. I feel like this is the Conte suggestion. We should be winning. <laughs> wow. Right. I love, I love Conte. I'd not... As a human or a manager, just as somebody else's manager, I love watching cons. <laughs> right, here we go. I'm, I'm not having two games on extended. I will vomit somewhere. I need more. We'll do the second leg. I can't have two giant games. Okay, come on, people. They're rubbish. They are rubbish. Okay? Probably should have checked away goals. Okay, encourage. Okay. Oh, I feel sick. I feel sick. Okay, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing at half time. I feel like we're playing Basingstoke. Oh, shit. 
Come on. Good clearance. Counter attack. No. Offside. Offside. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. What? Um. Let's get it to half time. We'll just sit to half time. Okay. It's better. A bit more possession. We need to score. I. I'm tempted to go two up top. No. No. Let's go. Let's go. Don't lose faith. Okay. Um. Do I go two up top? Is that a little bit risque? You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, you can stay on that. You can drop down to support. Stay attacking. Let's go. I actually don't not mind the number 10 in this formation, but we just don't have a very good number 10. Please, guys, can we score? Fire them up a bit. All great having possession and shots and stuff. Okay. There's a lot of yellow cards sitting there. Nice, oh, it's Kappa Ferry. All right, Lilo. Best player in the world. On for the Ballon d'Or. Look at that turn. Look at young Mo Salah. 14! Keep it. Keeper was so confident that it was going over that he stopped looking at the ball. <laughs> okay. Right. How how oomph, how much do we go for this? I feel like oh I'm I wanna go for it because I feel like they're hanging on, but I'm you know. This is going to bite me in the bottom. Taking any subs, you're all playing. We've got plenty of time for the second leg. How <sighs> we've had 20 <laughs> something shots. Okay, okay. That's my nephew. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna have any time. I prefer. -y. He won't take no for an answer. <laughs> Lilo! Lilo! Oh, he scores! He scores! On the volley! Oh, my word! He's a hero! 14 picks it up. Switches the play. Lungi with a lovely ball. And look at that for a... <laughs> what a finish! Oh, top goal scorer in the team. Lilo! Who'd have thought that of all the players that he'd be the one that's like, yeah, I got this, boss. All right. Three yellow cards, but they had a bunch of yellow cards. So there might be some suspensions. Okay, good. Deserve that win. Good. I will give Lilo a new contract. <laughs> what? I don't think, even if it was a boring game... Which it wasn't because we had 20 plus shots on, you know, at goal. I feel like a, a playoff relegation final winning that game, I think, would be a good reaction from the fans. I just, you know, I just. <sighs> All right, fine. Okay, good. How long have we got? I've got six days. Right. Second leg, let's go. Feeling confident. So, Kappa Ferry, he's got a bruised shoulder, he's out for nine days, so he's probably going to miss the match. A robust challenge during a training session. I'm assuming it was with this guy because he broke his ankle and he's out for eight months. You know, the guy we're having to sign. On seven grand a week. I swear, this, this, it's like, this team just tries to sabotage me at every injured following a fall. Okay. Oh, my God. That's really bad. Okay, fine. Whatever, game. Bring it on. Bring it on. It's not often you see such a badly run club. Not now. Like, before I got here. Not my fault, obviously. Um, wow, I do sound like Conte. Um, I just had that message saying, you know, the staff members that are, that are running out of contracts that have got a two-month, three-month left or whatever it is. And some of my staff members are on a £1,000 a week. <laughs> Right? <laughs> That's mental. Okay, right. Good. Glad we fixed that left-back issue. That... All right. 
You're there. Okay, we're all good. Danzy's back. Um. Oh, he's back, he's back, he's back. Okay, um, we have another central midfielder. Oh my God, I don't know what to do with myself. Okay. Dom, you've done great. You've done really good. But we, we have the guys back now. The band's back together. <laughs> We're just going to throw him in there. His legs are going to fall off, but his contract's probably running out, isn't it? Oh, no, of course not. He's got another year on five grand. Of course, of course. Right. Goalkeeper had another good game. Dickman played well. Got leave. This is the best it's ever going to be in it. Do we give fourteen? And he didn't. He just didn't do anything. Right, Zanola, get in there. Here we go. Let's not go attacking. That will. That would be a good start. Um, we'll keep as is the rest of it. Good luck, everybody. <sighs> it's going to be such a massive rebuild, as we saw. If I get rid of. All the players in the under-18s, all the players in the under-21s, all the players whose contracts are running out. I'll be left with about 10 players, but I will also be over the budget, a wage budget. <laughs> Which is impressive, but uh, if we get relegated, so therefore the budget will probably shrink even more, then it is nightmarish. Uh, so, <laughs> so we really do need to stay up. They might even sack me if I go down. We don't, you never know. Right, solid. This is what we want, second game. No highlights. Loving this, loving life. Free header. Wow. I think you had two or three men completely free at the back post there. It's fine. Good possession. Just keep the ball. <laughs> really good possession. All right, three quarters down. It's going very well. Now, I don't want to remind them. I don't want to put it in their heads, <laughs> the doubts. So let's not say that. We've dominated possession. Yes, and we know. It's, it's said many a time that possession doesn't necessarily mean goals. But generally speaking, if you've got the ball, it's hard for them to score. Hmm? Hmm? Okay. Oh, I feel sick. I absolutely feel sick. This is this, this is this is so important. We should encourage our players to try more long balls. Change the entire way you've been playing. No, no, no. I'm sticking with it. I'm not going defensive. Until it's like the last five minutes, okay? In these two games, I know this is kiss of death, but in these two games, they've not looked like scoring. Okay. Survive the highlight, survive the highlight. Go on, Dom. Zanola, play it! Lungi! Oh, we know he's finishing. He's deadly! Get in there, Lungi! Get in there! Fucking okay, hell, even a blind squirrel finds the odd nut. Well done, Lungi. Zanola involved, lovely run. I thought I was waiting for him to smash it over, and it is 1 0, 2 0 on aggregate. A really, prof weirdly, professional display over these two legs. Dominated both games. Maybe didn't score enough. All right, you can have that one. I'll just make a sub. It's not a time-wasting sub, it's a tactical sub. <clears throat> right. <laughs> don't, don't, don't. Look at this, you just right, it's not even like, He didn't even have to curl his like direct straight line from the boot to the top corner. I feel like we could have done a bit better. Right, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, I I feel fucking sick. This is no, no. 
Don't want to do it. I don't want to. Can't make me. We're not. We couldn't. We're not going to concede, are we? Oh, I feel sick. I feel sick. Okay, just keep the ball. Keep the ball. Please let it be our attack. That's it. Galanti. Fresh legs. Fresh legs. Yes, lovely. Dom, lovely. Good ball. Lilo. Go on. Yeah. No. Doesn't matter. It was our highlight. That's all I cared about. It was offside. Yeah. Let's go. Zanola. It's all Lilo, though. Dom's involved. Oh, the keeper. He's like. <laughs> <sighs> Suddenly, there's just endless highlights. You can have another one if you want for mana. Oh, I thought we were going for another one. Okay. I think it's a little bit closer than it probably should have, but we played great, just didn't finish our chances. We definitely need a striker. Nice. Here we go. Last five seconds. We're we looking for another goal. Plenty. Have a pop. Oh, here we go. He's through. Oh, you could have. That's rude. Let him have it. It would have been fine. Actually, no, because they would have added on a bit more. I have a question. See this building here? This is a building. On stilts with no way up. <laughs> I've just realized whatever this building is, I don't know how you would ever come up with that as an idea for like a oh, that'll do. Like this stuff makes sense, but why would you have that? Go back a few seconds, have a look at it. Right. Here we go. It's like winning the playoffs, but it's like, we not relegated. All right, ref. Hello, buddy. We're in the 94th minute, ref. Just so you know, just like if you were wondering what the time was. Uh, 94 minutes, ref. Um, hello. <laughs> Referee, there we go. Whew. Okay, we got there in the end. There you go, we won the first leg, and then we won the second leg, brilliant. Anything else game? Anything else you wanna throw in now? Hmm? Okay. We won the play out. What's the controversy? Oh. Whatever I said last time still stands, okay, good. So, we're definitely staying up, right? All good? <laughs> Let me just check there's no more fixtures. Because, you know, last time I had a Team Talk Zen. One of the, my favourite things, right? Because I recorded those last three episodes in a, in a batch. I was like, after the third episode, when I realised, obviously, there was a playoff, it just makes me laugh so much because then I could go back and check the comments. Like, in the first video, like, two videos ago or whatever it was, there was, I saw the comments, and there was just a couple of people that were like, isn't there a relegation playoff? And I thought, and I saw it, obviously I knew by then, but I, so I didn't, I didn't want to touch it. And then the next video was like, a couple of people go, there's a relegation playoff. I'm pretty sure there's a relegation. <laughs> I love that so much. Right. Okay. We are done. We are staying up, which <clears throat> like literally could be our survival as a club. It should be Lilo player of the season. 100%. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay. Yep, yep. Let's look at the finances. Tree. no new sponsors. Dickman, Lingy, Danzi, Capiferi. Okay. 1,400 shirts. Merch. Okay. Lungi. Once he got five goals, he was actually eventually our top goals with that last goal. Equal dot goal scorer. Um, 
Oh, okay. Dan's even nine assists. Dickman clue three player matches. Like, he's a good player. He'll be fine for us next season. He's, he'll be a solid player for us next season. We just need to, you know, maybe finish a few more shots. Uh, yep. Yeah, yeah. uh, and, uh, and performing well below expectations throughout. Under new manager, okay, as they were dragged into it. Harsh. <laughs> I don't think that's my fault. Got to be honest. Right. Okay. What do the board want? Oh, God. This is why you put yourselves in trouble, Monza. I, I don't know. Like, is it Pelasconi? I know he's not maybe known <laughs> for his business acumen, more his parties, but I feel like you shouldn't be giving us any transfer budget. And that's me me talking. Develop clubs, sign Italian players, work with them by net, sell players for a profit. Um, okay. Yeah. We can live with that. Accept that. Right. So, yeah. We know. Maybe a few of these players will sign now. Um, there's actually not that many that I want to sign. But let's see. From here to here. So, therefore, this is our team for next season. Plus him. <laughs> plus the random ones we're signing. Um, I'd like if we can get him a new contract. But there's... Uh, yeah, there's not actually that. Danzi is the only one I really want to keep. But then... His wages might be too much. Let's have a look. So they said 62k. Our committed spending is 66 as it... It's bad. It's quite bad. Um, how much if I move all of that budget into wages? Does it up it by five grand? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Not really. Not really great as ever. Only 6 million by the end and 11 million after that. I don't see... <clears throat> how we can really, like, improve next season, get into the playoffs or something like that. I just don't see how I can do it. Um, it's going to be a complete rebuild, even more so than normal, because obviously a bunch of the players are leaving, but nearly all the staff are leaving, and they are on ridiculous rages. It's one of my pet hates of football managers, that let's say you're a, a League 2 club, and you sign a scout for 200 quid a week, and you give him a year's contract... I find staff always want massive pay rises. So with staff, you're almost better just replacing them at the end of each contract rather than giving people a new contract, which is which is pretty rubbish for smaller clubs that are on a budget. Like, it's it's pretty annoying. But we're, I have a lot of work to do. On that note, there will be no uh, video tomorrow, my Friday video. Um, well, one, because of, I've got to do this. It might take a bit of time. Because I haven't, I haven't been able to even pre-sign anybody because of the wages. But also, um, it's been a, almost a year now, which is well, it's about 11 months since I've been in this house and the landlord is coming to visit. So, for the like, first time in about nine months, okay, so I'm going to just make sure it's all spotless. I'm going to hide all the hookers and the meth lab. Tommy, if you don't know what hookers and meth lab are, just ask your dad, all right? But, um, yeah, got to make sure it's all right so I don't get thrown out. That's right. But there we go, my friends. We are done. We have survived again. Twice now. It feels like we have survived. Next episode might be a couple of new faces. I wonder if Mossy fancies a trip. <laughs> Moss mm -hmm. How much is Mossy on? I can't remember his wages. Uh, six grand. Maybe not. Maybe not. Right. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like. If you enjoyed it, my Ukrainian friends, stay safe and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.